Hello and welcome to Glitter Shine Nails. Featuring in this video are the final two stamping plates from Nicole Diary Nature World set ND004 and ND005. I've already swatched and reviewed the first three which you can find in the Nicole Diary playlist here on my channel. So I'll be swatching and reviewing these two beautiful stamping plates and as always you can find where I purchased them from in the description box below. Before we get started, please subscribe to my channel and make sure you have the bell notification turned on. And please also like this video. These really do help out my channel. Thank you. I have my scraper and my Nail Artisan Tiffany Duo stamper. I'll begin with ND004 and I've got six coloured nail tips. I'll be taking three swatches from each plate and I'm going to start with a green nail tip along with a teal stamping polish. Now I will say that I do think these images should have been round the other way, but that's just me. So with images like this, I always remove any excess that I've picked up and I'll remove that with my lint roller. So with images like these, any excess I pick up, I will remove. And so that I get most of the image, I am going to put this slightly off angle. On to the next swatch and I'll be using a yellow nail tip along with a red stamping polish. With the photo swatches I did mainly place them in the middle so to get as much on as possible but they can really go anywhere and they look stunning especially with all that detail they have. For the next swatch I'm going to use a red nail tip along with a white stamping polish. Now my first swatch didn't pick up properly and I'm putting that down to the hit or miss that I have with white stamping polishes. But on my second try it picks up so much better. I don't know why I have issues with whites. On to the next stamping plate, ND005. For the first swatch I'm using a white nail tip and I'm going to use a neon pink and a green stamping polish. I'm going to use the flamingo image and how I did the photo swatch. So I'll place the neon pink over the flamingos and then I'll place the green over the leaves. Now when it comes to scraping, I will only scrape once. I don't want them colors to blend too much together, but it's a pretty cool effect though. On to the next swatch and I'm going to use a blue nail tip along with a blue stamping polish. I almost used this image for my Manny, but I felt that I always do butterflies, but it's an utterly stunning design and one I definitely know I'll be using very soon. And I love it in this color combo, the extra bits I will remove later with a cotton bud and some acetone. On to the next swatch and I'm going to use a beige nude nail tip along with a brown stamping polish. Again, this is another stunning image with a lot of gorgeous detail. I think for me, I would love to color this image in and really bring it to life, but even that little bird is adorable. And then here they are all together. And as you can see, I've removed the excess from the blue butterfly. So let's move on to the photo swatches and manis that I've created from these two Nature World stamping plates from Nicole Diary. ND004 is absolutely stunning. In total, there is 24 designs, of which I call jewellery designs. With designs like these, you can place them at the top of the nail, or halfway down, or even turn them upside down and use as French Manny designs. There is a couple of designs which you can just use in the middle of the nail. And for these swatches, I have placed them all in the middle. So you're gonna get to see most of the image. And I'm intrigued to add these designs to some manis. I think they will add something different, even if it's just on say, the ring finger. But you could use a few designs to make a whole mani like the one that I have created. And uh, Nature World ND004 was really easy to use. Anyone would be able to use them. They're also really purse friendly too. I paid £1.59 for each plate and I'm loving the sets like the Nature World and the Animal World. They're really some great plates in the sets. 
So onto the Manny and I've used a green gel polish from Your Sugar that was featured in my last video and I've stamped in white. I've used a mix of three designs and I really like how this has turned out. Very simple and quite understated. You could even turn this Manny using the right colours into say a bridal nail. Now please excuse the thumb picture, I'm still figuring out the best angle for that one. Nature World ND005 and there is 12 very beautiful animal designs. There's a great mix of animals from sea creatures to the toucan to flamingo to the lion or even a unicorn. There's quite a bit to choose from. Now I found these images quite large so if you have slim or short nails you might not fit it all onto your nail. This is definitely a plate I want to return to very soon. I've just had a load of nail polishes arrive and I can see a couple of them for these designs. This has been a brilliant set to work with and if you've missed the first video you can find it in my Nicole Diary playlist here on my channel. It's definitely worth checking out. I definitely want to use the flamingo and the toucan but also, yes you've guessed it, the butterfly. I also want to try to create a mani using all five plates together. I think that would be really good to do. These manis will be over on my Instagram when I create them. So for the mani I used the blue Your Sugar Gel Polish again from my last video and I've stamped in a dark blue. I decided to use all of the sea creature designs for this mani as I thought they would work really well together with the blue gel polish and I just love it. Now I couldn't quite get all the images on but to be honest that really doesn't matter. All of my swatches will be over on my Instagram page in the next few days along with the manis and what products I've used. There is a link in the description box below. Thank you for viewing my swatch review on these two Nature World Nicole Diary stamping plates. I hope that you've enjoyed it. If you did then please give me a thumbs up, I would really appreciate it. Comment below, I'd love to hear from you. Hit that subscribe button and share. Also don't forget to come over and follow me on my Instagram page at Glittershine Nails. So until next time, happy stamping and bye.